Good morning everyone. Uh, welcome back again to another Sunday's best uh, episode here in uh, Montalban Rizal. Uh, andito kami ngayon sa Barangay Mascap and uh, ang plano namin is umakit ng Mount Ayaas uh, behind me pero hindi na kami aabot ng summit since it's a uh, hiker's uh, place preferably. Um, papunta na kami dun sa may Noah's Ark and uh, it's a main attraction na pinupuntahan ng mga bikers uh, since hindi pwedeng magpunta ng summit nang hindi iniwanan yung bike. So that's the original plan. It's one of the best place dito sa Mascap kasi it's I, Mount Ayaas is part of the trilogy uh, um, na inakit ng mga mountaineers dito. So the first one will be the Sipit Ulang. The second one will be the Spadang Bato. And then the third one is the Mount Ayaas. So Mount Ayaas yung pinakamataas doon sa uh, tatlong yun. Uh, it's about 627 meters above sea level if I'm not mistaken. And uh, it's a beginner-friendly daw since um, 3 out of 9 daw yung difficulty ng um, terrain for the hikers. For bikers, uh, medyo matarik siya. <laughs> Ang grade niya is about 25% dito sa mga ahon. So, may mga pagkakataon na tulak pero susubukan naming ahunin. And it's uh, a challenge na um, hinaharap namin ngayon ni uh, Tony. Okay, so we're approaching the first ascent dito sa jump off ng uh, Muscap packet ng Mount Ayaas and uh, reminder lang medyo matarik dito the grade is about 20 to 25 percent so talagang respect yung gagawin namin kasi last time that we went here hindi namin kinaya <laughs> so this is the second time that we went here and sana kayaanin namin so tara tingnan nyo ako no nice one <laughs> so ayun sana kayaanin namin Alright, so di kina ayan na lagligan ng kadena. Uh, let's see. Baba ulit ako, and then let's see kung kaya natin dyan yung to. Uh, it's about 200, or I think it's about 100 lang. It's about 100 meters from dun sa start until dun sa uh, next stop na medyo recovered. So let's see. Baba ako, and then let's see kung kakayanin natin na di pa back end. Let's go! Go! Maki! 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 Mama! Maki! 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 Go! Go! This is almost the end of the second steep segment dito sa Mount Ayaas. And uh, konti na lang nabitin pa kami. <laughs> so, hindi na kinaya. Um, siguro, didiretso yun natin doon. Hanggang dulo, pagkaya na. And uh, na-overwhelm lang kami kasi talaga na-miss namin dito. So, uh, mas okay sana kung medyo moist yung uh, lupa para mas kumakapit yung gulong. And uh, yung tire pressure plays a big role para maahon talaga to. And right now, we're at uh, 35 PSI since more roads and then konti lang yung trails na um, aakyatin natin. Pero, there's no excuse. Papalakas pa uli ang mga lolo nyo <laughs> bago natin maahon ng diretso to. So, there's no shame in secret gear. Uh, tulak mode. And then, padyak uli after. So, tara. Tuloy tayo.
We're here on the uh, trail end of the last segment ng steep ascent dito sa Mount Ayaas. Um, this is the fourth one. And nakala ko tatlo lang. As far as I can remember, tatlo lang. And apat pala to. Pero look at the freaking view. Ay, hindi pala yan. Ito pala. <laughs> this one. There. See? Great views comes after the hardest climbs. So imagine a 26 grade ascend. Aahunin mo after a 30 kilometer ride from your place. Medyo laspag na. And hopefully makaabot kami dun sa summit. You can see. That. That's the summit. Let's see sa mga locals kung kakayanin ng bike dun. For now, let's go ahead and make tulak. Right? <laughs> Alright, so um, right now we're here at the view deck um, bago umakyat na Mount Ayaas uh, Summit and uh, unfortunately, um, hindi na kami tutuloy hanggang dun sa summit since ang sabi ng isang nakausap natin na local is hindi bikeable yung packet dun and uh, you need to register uh, para bago umakyat ng summit for your safety na rin um, you, you will need to have a tour guide and uh, iwanan yung mga bisikleta bago makakyat dun so, um, cancel na again <laughs> for the second time. Uh, right now, the, the plan will be um, baba kami ng puray and uh, check kung ano yung mga pinagbago ron. Um, hindi pa ako nakapunta ron, although si Tony, yung kasama ko ngayon, is nakahilang beses na. So, it's gonna be my first time going there. And uh, let's see kung uh, malakas yung tubig doon. No? Baba muna tayo and uh, we'll go back on a POV mode. And, uh, para mas showcase kung ano yung mga downhill sections dito naman sa Mount Ayaas. So, tara, let's go.
So, andito na kami sa Puray. And, uh, iniwan na namin yung bike doon since hiking pala dito. Or rather, trekking ang mangyayari. Trekking, river crossing. Pag nakaklits kayo, asahan nyo na mababasa. So, bao na lang ng chinelas. And, uh, hindi kami ready. So, wala. Basa shoes talaga. Oo. Oh. Tara. trekking talaga <laughs> ang dami na nagbubuhat ng bike dito so pag pupunta kayo dito alam nyo na discampe iwan bike para tahimik ang trekking nyo tigay nagbubuhat see minor lang naman siya mabato lang at madulas pag medyo basa yung and since nakaklits kami ha madulas <laughs> so ito na narinig na namin yung falls let's see dami daw tao eh Alright, so I think that's it. Uh, thank you so much again for tuning in on another episode of our bike ride here in uh, Montalban, Rizal. So right now, we're here on the first uh, spillway pag pupunta kayo ng Puray and uh, pa-uwi na kami. Um, well, the reason why nandito kami sa Bungad is because we made a reverse. So we went to Mount Ayaas kanina. Well, not really dun sa summit, pero somewhere there in Ayaas and Owas Arc. And then, nag-turn uh, around na kami since hindi na bikeable dun sa summit. So we went on the reverse and then doon kami dumaan sa Ulingan after na lumabas kami ng uh, uh, Puray Elementary uh, School and then dumiretso na ng Puray. So yeah, um, it's currently 10.30 in the morning so quick lunch lang and then afternoon uwi na kami via Batasan. Um, roughly it's about um, 70 km ride again. Um, we rode out around 4.30 in the morning. Medyo mabagal um, kasi uh, yun nga ang daming obstacles na dinaanan kasi may semi um, trekking kanina dun sa uh, riverside ng Puray. Pero right now, um, okay na okay na magpunta dito since um, before, there are about 13 river crossings bago ka makapunta ng Puray. But right now, inayos na nila. Uh, there's a lot of spillways um, on the riverside and uh, mas, ano na, uh, mas accessible na yung papunta ng Puray. Although right now, it's, you know, it's a uh, summer, almost summer and uh, kung nakita nyo naman kanina na medyo pahina na yung tubig dun sa puray and parami yung tao so yun, um, again uh, we always suggest na sana if uh, gusto nyo ma-enjoy yung mga lugar na pinupuntahan namin um, you guys do it on a weekdays para mas sasulit bukod sa konti ang tao mas uh, free to move given the situation na may pandemic pa so, yun. Um, always uh, stay safe, guys. Um, always follow minimum protocols. And of course, um, yung mga reminders ng LGU, lagi lang natin susundin. Wala pa kami mask kasi managing distance naman kami. Pero bago umahon dito, mask, alcohol, and then 
you guys know the drill. So thank you again. Please like, subscribe, and share. Um, thank you lahat sa support nyo. Um, slowly but surely, and eventually, darating din tayo doon. So thank you again. Till our next ride. Cheers.